To choose the right application for a particular file, you need to know what type of file it is. To determine the type of file, we need to open up Windows Explorer and navigate to a file. I'm going to go to a picture file that is located in my pictures folder. When I select the image that I want, you can see down below on the Explorer window that the information about the image is displayed. On the left, underneath the file name, is the file type. This image is a JPEG image, which is a very common picture format. I'm going to navigate to a document to show you what it looks like. For the document that I created in a previous video, you can see that it tells us that it's saved in the rich text format. Another way to view information about the file is to right click on it and select properties. The properties window shows us all the information about the file. Notice that it also shows the program that will open the file if we double click on it. Click OK or click Cancel to close the Properties window. Now I'm going to double click on the image to open it. When I do so, the default program, Windows Photo Viewer, opens the program. We will discuss more about this program in an upcoming video. If I want to open the program with a different application than Windows Photo Viewer, then I would need to right click on the file and hover over Open With on the list. Windows will display all of the programs that can open the file on this list. This list will vary depending on the programs that you have installed on your computer. If you have any of the Windows Live programs installed, then you will see them on this list like you do here. Programs can also save files in formats that can only be opened with that program. For example, on my computer, I have a Windows Live Movie Maker file. This file has been created with the program called Windows Live Movie Maker. If the program was not installed on the computer, then I would not be able to open the file. If you have a file type that you are unsure of what program opens it, try to do a Google search for it. For example, in Google, type in how to open a PDF file. Remember that you want to use the correct program when creating a file. If I want to create a text document that had a lot of formatting, I would want to use a word processing program like WordPad or Microsoft Word. It would be possible to use an image editing program to enter in text onto a document, but it would create a lot more work for me because the program is not made for handling multiple pages of text. There are many more types of files that we did not discuss in this video. I just want you to know that different types of files have to be open with different types of programs depending on what type of file it is. This concludes a look at how to choose the right software application.